Sussex jealous rage in Montecito as Kate and William ruined their Nobel Prize with new royal strategy. Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge and Prince William have adopted a new strategy to help modernize royal family traditions long before they become king and queen, a royal expert claimed. Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge, and Prince William have taken on an increasingly leading role in recent years, cementing their position as the future king and queen. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge have stepped up since the start of the health crisis in 2020 as the Queen was forced to take a step back from public duties. And they have begun to make their mark with a new strategy to help modernize the royal family in preparation for their future role, according to commentator Charlie Langston. While, fans of Harry and Meghan are convinced the royal couple could be in the running for the Nobel Peace Prize. The Sussex Squad as they have been dubbed, messaged royal journalist Richard Eden to celebrate the news. The commentator then tweeted about the fans' excitement and the suggesting they could be in the running for the accolade. It comes as the Duke and Duchess of Sussex were honoured by the NAACP, National Association for the Advancement of Coloured People. The reports on the dialogue between fans of the couple and speculated about the likelihood of them winning. Richard Eden wrote, Prince Harry and Meghan's cheerleaders are tweeting me, seriously, suggesting that, next, the couple will be nominated for a Nobel Peace Prize. Underneath, account Wake and Abertha for Sussex Royals wrote, You are really not going to tweet about the, Civil Rights Group, NAACP award? So why should someone follow your show if it's biased and not covering news like this? You know the Nobel Peace is next right? Stay mad. Speaking to Access, Ms. Langston said, William and Kate are already not acting as though they are already the leaders of the monarchy but they are taking on a huge amount of responsibility, not just in terms of public engagements but also in terms of the way in which the monarchy is run. They are making small but very important changes, opening up the monarchy to a more modern point of view, not perhaps in a way is noticeable every single day. But bit by bit they have helped the monarchy to evolve, to embrace new traditions, and to maintain the important heritage of the past while saying, a few of the things that we used to do are seen to be very stuffy. They are very stuffy, here's ways we can maintain the tradition behind these things without making it appear as though we are completely ignorant to what the rest of the world is doing and how they're living. The couple have been praised for their hard work and for bringing a real relevance among younger generations of Britons. Royal commentator Emily Nash said, I think William and Kate have brought a real relevance to the monarchy. They are young, they're very good looking, Kate's certainly injected quite a lot of glamour. But more importantly perhaps, they're working on subjects that are very relevant to the younger generation at the moment. Squire York wrote, if Greta doesn't get Nobel Peace Prize then it should go to Meghan Duchess of Sussex or Justin Trudeau. Harry, 37, and Meghan 40, are expected to attend the NAACP Awards this weekend to collect the President's Awards to mark their achievement for distinguished public service. Previous winners include Muhammad Ali, Rihanna, LeBron James, Bill Clinton and Venus and Serena Williams. It is their first major Hollywood event since they chose to leave the royal family in January 2020 and relocate to America. The couple said in a statement before the awards, it's a true honor to be recognized by President Derek Johnson and the NAACP, whose efforts to propel racial justice and civil rights are as vital today as they were nearly 115 years ago. We're proud to support the NAACP's work and to also partner with the organization on the newly created annual NAACP Archul Digital Civil Rights Award, which will be bestowed to Dr. Sophia Noble as part of the 53rd NAACP Image Awards. The reported NAACP President Derek Johnson response, which said, We're thrilled to present this award to Prince Harry and Meghan.